We're getting spots up there. There's a guy right there. Ellie, nice. Fuck you, bitch. Oh, that was sick. Hey everyone, welcome back to The Last of Us Remastered on Grounded Difficulty. Alright, so in this part we've, um, in the last part actually, we entered the university looking around for fireflies. I haven't found a single firefly. And you'd think that fireflies are actually a massive group because they're so well known around pretty much the whole of America. And what we've seen across so far, everyone knows who they are. Right, we're inside. Come on, kiddo, give me your hand. Let's look around. Hello? There's been a lot of evidence of um, their base being here because we have a lot of um, camps and tents set up and notes left around talking about like sniper nests and stuff like that but we're just not seeing any and we're also not seeing many infected we'd expect them to be if they did get turned so they must have left the area that's what it looks like so far just check all these rooms see if we can find any signs of life there's a bunch of weapon parts in there, there's a bench there as well no point using a bench until we find more tools to actually upgrade some of the weapons power found some scissors in there must be getting close now to having a hundred pills yeah we got 90 so once we get 10 more we'll be reducing the weapon sway a whole lot more some explosive powder there oh. fireflies care for mankind over here anyone Let's keep it down until we figure out what's going on. Yeah, Ellie, I wouldn't be shouting just yet. Seeing as we haven't seen any fireflies and they could be turned into infected. Wouldn't be causing too much attention towards myself. Finding a lot of weapon parts in here, though. So I think that there's another door here. I'm guessing this is going to be a shiv door. Yeah, you can just tell, kind of, because it's like a door on its own. It's like, yeah, that's definitely a shiv door. I'm not just crafting a sh crafting a shiv just to get through one of them. There's no, I don't think there's a way to check <coughs> how many charges you've got on your Cohen's me melee weapon, because that's what I'd upgrade. Nothing useful. Ain't nothing here but a bunch of medical mumbo jumbo. I don't get it. it. Looks like they all just packed up and left in a hurry. Maybe not all of them. Stay close. Definitely doesn't sound like a human being that clumsy. Sounds more like an infected bumping into shit. Right, there's nothing over there. Let's go upstairs. You might want to crouch a bit once we get up here as well, just to stay stealth. Quickly check on the ammo. Make sure we got no. We got a shotgun shell and flamethrower. We've also got no other pistol weapons that are worth equipping because the the ammo is empty. On them all, flashlights running out. Shake that. We've actually got two arrows though, which is more than we've had for a long time. I love the the mechanics for the bow and arrow in this game. It just feels so natural and. Feels like you're just being a badass when you fire one. It takes someone out of one shot. There are no bodies. That's good, right? We find out where they went. Pick up a brick. They always come in handy. Yes, they definitely left the place. There being no bodies around, like Ellie's just pointed out. It's a cupboard there. Some more blades. We're actually finding quite a few parts in here. Some blades and tape. So we'll probably be able to make some um, weapon upgrades, you know, the melee weapon attachment soon. Or even now, maybe. I think it's worth putting it on a like a blade as well, like a machete, upgrading that. Because then you've got just more charges with it. 
as well as the um, standard ones, which are one hit kills anyway. Okay, most of this is empty. No door we can go through here. Whoa! It was because I was running towards the door as I opened it. Joel just went crazy. Okay, so we got 10 pills there. We, we can upgrade our weapon sway so we can be more accurate. Yeah, we can upgrade this. I'm going to upgrade this now, I think. Just make the machete better. So it's got more charges on it. Oh, he's put some scissors on it as well, actually. The scissors on the bottom, on the handle of it. How is that going to make it more effective? Doesn't make any sense. If you look at his back. Swing it. like There's just a scissors cutting into his own hand. How does make it, that make it more effective? Oh, I just love the bricks. Looks like it's a tent here. Oh god. Shit. Um so it's probably clickers, right? No, clickers don't hide. I think if it was if it was clickers as well, you'd be hearing the click. That noise. Okay, we'll check on this side and then we'll make our way through the door behind us. There's a little um fungal x-ray. So they put x-rays on clickers that they must have um, found and killed. Oh, it just m m destroys your skull, doesn't it? Growth's all over your, your bone. Jesus. Okay, so it's monkeys making all the noise. These today, clickers. Well, maybe in all that research, they turn into fucking monkeys. Just keep searching, we'll find something. Do they normally keep monkeys in universities to experiment on or something? That doesn't make sense to me. I thought that being like a crazy... Unless the fireflies actually brought the monkeys here. Maybe they did, I don't know. Just guessing. Empty, empty, empty. They look like you can pick them up, them, those pink boxes. What are they? Flexi... Something. I don't know what it is. Probably paracetamol or something. The box looks like a pregnancy kit, though, to me. Another drawer. Oh, we've actually got quite a lot of stuff in here. Loads of stuff. Freak parts. That's crazy. And we still can't craft anything with that. Let's open this door. It's been locked for a reason. There was actually a dead body in here. You're looking for the fireflies. They've all left. Yeah, no shit. Do you know where that is? I know the city. Is it far? It ain't close. I mean, on horseback. What? Fireflies? Get down! <laughs> oh! <gasps> what the fuck are these guys? It don't matter. We know where to go. Let's get the hell out of here. So we're heading to Salt Lake City next. First, we've got to take out these um, hunters again. How are these guys finding us? I think it's strange how they said the Fireflies have returned to Salt Lake City. If they're returning to it, they've been there before, and why did they leave in the first place? And if it's safe enough to go back. Hello! <laughs> oh shit! Hey! <laughs> Jeez. Okay, we just got a shotgun shell there. Before we carry on, I'm gonna load that shotgun up. There's actually an axe on the floor there. I wanna quickly 
compare my weapon with that weapon. I've got three hits on mine. This has got... That's got like five hits. I'm going to equip that for now. And we'll probably use it in this section. And we'll come back if that, if that machete's still got more charges at the end of it. So there's going to be some more hunters around here. There they go. In the distance. Whoa. How many was that? Four? Ellie, get down. Crazy bitch. Got to make all these shots count now. Got to make sure no one comes from the right hand side as well. Because those rooms are all connected over there. Nice headshot. Nice. Headshot, bitch. Have we got any more weapons on this? Nope. Shit. Good, good spot, Ellie. Ellie, what are you doing? Is she killing him? Ellie, what, are you, what the fuck are you doing, Ellie? Get out there. You crazy, crazy bitch. Ow. Move over, move over. Get a brick. I'm, I'm not jumping up and taking these shots here because I'm just trying to calm the situation so I can pick my shots a lot better. We haven't got many ranged weapons here. The shotgun's got more range on it now, actually. I've upgraded it, haven't I? So you might be able to get this guy from this distance. I wonder if I throw a brick over there that'll get his attention. No. So we need to get closer definitely to here and make it any of these shots worthwhile taking. Let's scoot across this side. Get in there. I want these guys to come out. Is that guy's aiming his shotgun through the wall there? You see that? The clipping? It's a bit messy. It might be better actually if we go on the left hand side and try and flank them. Just want to test it, see if they move. So they're both still in there. I'm going to go out and go around this build, this room, and hopefully we can try and flank them if they're still looking outside that way. Okay, we actually are in stealth. Where's the other guy gone? There's only one. I can only see one guy. Shit. Where's the other guy gone? Grab this one anyway. Where's the other one? Fuck, I'm scared. I don't know where the other guy's gone. There he's outside. So we'll take this guy out. This guy might spot us. Even if he does, it's only one guy, so we should be able to take him out pretty easily. He didn't actually spot us, so that's good. So while he goes around that way, he probably spots the body. Yeah, he's checking the body out. We'll grab him. Stomp on his face. Nice. So that went quite well, actually. Didn't actually take any damage. Do you know what I'm thinking as well? That was a waste earlier on when I upgraded the um, the machete. Because now we've got an axe and it's better. So it's a bit of a waste. But obviously I didn't know I was going to be getting a um, new weapon at that point. Should have probably saved it when I didn't have a bladed weapon and upgraded a blunt one to make it more effective. Shit, there's a guy there. Is that guy on his own? There's two of them. Three of them. Fucking hell. Shit. Whoa. What's caused this? Fuck, there's a guy there as well. So, um, we're going to back this guy up into this corner over here. So if someone does come in, we can shoot them. Otherwise, we're just going to choke this guy. Just going to choke him now behind this desk. We're getting spotted there. There's a guy right there. Ellie, nice! Fuck you, bitch! Oh, that was sick! That was teamwork! That was so fucking sick! Oh! There's a better axe there as well. Because I just used that one. Ooh, because my plan right then when I was choking that guy was to equip the brick and smash that guy's face in. But he kind of jumped me a bit much, so I threw it at him first to stun him, and then just finished him off with the uh, axe. So we didn't actually lose much of any ammo right there, especially with the last three guys. Choked one, axed one in the neck, and Ellie took care of the rest. What a champ. Right. Um, are we going downstairs or that way? Well, no. That's the way we came, isn't it? That door connects to the cover door we've just been down. So we're going to go down. 
Um, trying to get behind this cover. There's a guy here. Take out that bitch. I just did that quickly just to minimize the numbers on of enemies. Take a brick to the face, bitch. Now we can switch this weapon to the revolver. Reload that. Try and find some bricks before we carry on. See if there's a brick around here somewhere. Doesn't look like there is. So let's get some cover around here. There's a guy there. We can actually use this pistol we just picked up to make that one shot to the head. Oh, it wasn't a headshot, but we still killed him in one shot. Shot him in the like in the collar. Reload this weapon again. Look at that. The way he's like landed. It's so cool, the um, physics in this game. Look at the blood splatter on the wall. That looks like it's being put there by the developers. But it's just being done by me. It's so freaking cool. Shit. Spam square. Uh Oh, fuck. That's gonna leave a mark. Fucking hell. Shit, this guy's coming through that door there. I think Ellie shot that guy. Oh man. Joel? I'm gonna need you to pull. Okay. Alright, you ready? One, two, three! Oh! Holy shit. Let's get to the damn horse. Okay. How much blood's just pissing out his back, and Ellie's covered in blood now as well. Okay, Ellie being a little badass with her gun. Cover me, Ellie. Fuck. <laughs> Holy shit. Be careful. Those were my friends you killed, asshole. Can I shoot this guy, or is Ellie gonna take him? You wanna do this the hard way? I think Ellie's gonna take this guy, isn't he? Nice, Ellie. Okay, finished him off for you. Hope Ellie didn't get shot there. We gotta get you out of here. I'm okay. You're not okay, Joel. Now come on. He's losing a lot of blood. Fuck me. This section is like so well done. It's like a cinematic, but also you're in full control. You're doing good. Just keep at it. Okay. Look at these double doors. Oh man. Here, lean on me. No. Well, can you walk? Yes. Then fucking walk. Come on. I barely see. Joel! Behind you! What? What the fuck's that message in the corner? Home screen? What? The kid's got a gun! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Joel! Here! Stand up! <laughs> Let's go. I swear to God. 
I get you out of this. Just stop singing for me. <laughs> Still cracking jokes. Ellie, like, you can't help but love her. Wait here. I'll get the door. Take your time. Fucking oh, Ellie's wasting everyone here. Come on. Just get the horse. Alright. Can you get on? I think we're safe. Joel? Joel? Shit. Joel, here. Oh, get up, get up, get up. You gotta tell me what to do. Come on. You gotta get up. Joel? Joel's fucked. And now it's winter, which just makes it even worse. Bunny rabbit. Oh. Oh, fuck off. Oh. This won't last very long. You'll just startle it. Where'd you go? All right, so we're playing as Ellie now. It looks like she's hunting a deer. Um, we don't even know if Joel's in a condition to carry on or what, what's happened to him. There he is. There's a deer over there. So it looks like we're gonna, that's our objective right now, to hunt down the deer. And we're gonna take that deer out in the next part, guys. So I'm gonna end it here. Alright everyone, see you in the next part. Bye!